Don't miss out. Today I'm going to wall hop like a pro through hard but unique stages such as wall hop stick outs, wall hop wrap arounds, wall hop head hitters, and so much more. Welcome to Pancake's Wall Hop Difficulty Chart Obby, the place where dreams get crushed. Alrighty, let's look at the donation board. 120,000 Robux. You gotta be jacking. Oh my god, that's a freaking ton. Alright, that could have that could have been spent on a few squids, you know? Alright, here we go. Wall hop. Yes, easy, easy. Easy. Alright, for the wall hop, you want to aim for your knees. Reason being is because you can wall hop with your hips and just underneath your feet. So aiming for the middle gets the best of both worlds. Like so. There we go, too easy. Alrighty. Just so you're aware, when you're wall hopping, it is recommended to practice the timing. The timing looks like this. So, you want to make sure you practice each wall hop so you can get a rhythm, get a feel for it. Once you get a feel for it, you can actually do so much with wall hops. It's insane. So, practicing timing is key. Now, in most wall hop games, you will see the alignment keys, which is basically the less than and more than keys. Do not use them for normal wall hops. Only use them for practicing your timing. Reason being is because it is very stationary and can be difficult for later on. So, basically, using your screen is key. Just turning 45 degrees to the right helps you out so much. Now, it is recommended to have high camera sensitivity. You're probably wondering what's my camera sensitivity. Mine is actually 0.52. Now, you can change your desktop settings to whatever you want. All right, so basically the Roblox app shouldn't be solely what your camera sensitivity is about. So basically using your Windows or Mac camera sensitivity is a good idea. But for mobile users, yes, you will need to use the Roblox camera sensitivity because mobile users have a unique feature and look look you see how i'm going the other way now i can wall hop both directions so left and right Alrighty. oh straight up and out oh now we go into the slope wall hops all right and there Stage 27. I mean, it's actually getting a little bit harder, but still fairly easy to for me. All right, around here. And... All right. We're up to hard difficulty. Getting close, getting close to the top. All right. So, this game wouldn't be fun without a couple of people. Time to announce this server to the fans. Give me one moment. All right, so if you want to be in a video, be sure to join this Discord server and you can do just that. Boom. All right, I believe they're coming in. I'm sorry, Yuli Yop. You cannot be in this video, I'm sorry. Here's a little shout out for you. So we've got the people, the people's choice. Hey guys. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and do the obby as per normal. So we've got cylinder wall hops. Oh, interesting. So with cylinder wall hops, you can actually hold D then tap W once you get to the wall. That's also a strategy I use a lot. All right, now straight up and out and around here and up, yes. So if you continue to wall hop, you can get used to this stuff. All right, there we go. All right, now sideways wall hop. Now, this one you can use alignment keys, so, so the less than more than key, but I don't recommend it. Do not use it. I only use it if you're practicing the timing. Because the key thing you should be practicing on is your camera doing the flicks. Because it works for all games and alignment keys is actually a man-made thing. But it used to be a thing. Alignment keys used to be on Roblox. But then Roblox removed it because of it being abundant. So not being useful. So essentially it used to be O and I for zoom out and zoom in. 
and then alignment keys for left and right. It'd just be like that for a while un until they removed it. And then I had to dramatically upload videos of newly improved wall hop methods. So that's why I like using my camera because it's safer. All right, oh, sick, okay. Oh yes, we're smashing this. Oh, sick, sick. Okay. And long jump. You know what? It's actually getting fairly easy. Not harder, easy. I like I like hardness to obbies because they feel more natural to me. All right, straight up. And we go this way, follow the arrow. Now around here, over there, and long jump. We'll hop up and up, getting higher. And there we go. And now, oh, this is actually an interesting one. This is actually an upgrade on the difficulty. All right, I tend to just hold W and D for this. So basically your camera can turn around the bends and such. That's, that's the bonus of not using alignment keys. You have more freedom. For those ones, you can just hold in D and then tap W just to get more distance, you know? Oh, sick design. Okay, straight over. And there we go. Stage 50. We're actually smashing this out. Stage 52. All right, around the bend. Oh, a little wrap around. A little wrap around. I thought this was a wall hop game. Come on, where's the head hitters? I want to. I want to see head hitters. All right, sick. All right, and around that bend. And down, and around. Get up, get up, and get down. Oh, oh, oh GG. Probably the first instance of a stick out. Oh, a little slope. Oh, oh, and wall hop. Yes, we're up to intense. Oh, a little head hitter. So basically for this one, you want to wall hop, hold S, and then hold W. Now this is the perfect time to say it. If you guys don't like the video, subscribe to the channel, and you start get screened by Robux and Premium. If you guys don't, then you can just... And thank you, Robux, for the star code. You guys are amazing. Ah. Yes, there we go. All right. Oh, hoo, 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 hoo. you're getting a bit flawless. Oh, wow, wow. Wowie, that's a hard one. Oh, hoo, hoo. you know what I found out? So many people want to learn how to wall hop. It's insane how much people want to learn. And I'd love to teach you guys. That's why I made this video. It was mainly to teach you guys and also show you what it's like to utilize advanced wall hop methods. Now for this one, you just hold D and you wrap around it. And there we go, 67. Oh, it's getting pretty hard. Yes, GG. Now cylinder. Oh, cylinder stick outs. Very interesting.
Oh, sick. Okay, so this is left, then right. See, everyone's so fixated on right wall hops. Practice the left ones as well. They're useful sometimes. Oh, pink, remorseless. Yes, stage 70, 2.5 degree angle. Fairly easy, just less consistent. Yes, yeah, straight up and boom. Oh, a little stick out. Or maybe a little, little lodge, little wedge. What do you call it? A little gap, that's it. All right, truss. And wall hop. Out, there we go. My favorite style of obbies would have to be wall hops. Let me know what your favorite style of obby is in the comments down below. Oh, yes, there we go. Yes, straight around. Yes, GG, we did it together, nice. Yes, there we go. Yes, there we go, nice. All right, so that was a, a a gap wall hop. A wall hop through a gap. All right, oh, this is very sick. I love this type of wall hop. So what you wanna do is you wanna make sure your leg is halfway between the ledge of the ground, turn, and tap S a bit just to go down a bit, and wall hop. Oh, come on. Getting close. Yes, GG. Yes, GG. 79. Oh, interesting. All right, insane mode. All right, so if you guys want a part two of me completing the whole entire obby, please hit 100 likes. Have a good one, guys. See you later.